I'm Luscious Lane Lane, and I've been asked to introduce this next match, myself versus Kamikaze Kid in Austin, Minnesota. And as you'll see as you watch the match, the beating that Kamikaze took in the hands of myself, Luscious Lenny Lane. And that's why I just got back from Monday Nitro, and he just got back from Burger King watching Monday Nitro. So enjoy the match, and for myself and Mick, we'll see you next week back on the show. And gentlemen, if you don't like if you don't like violence and graphic, oh my, oh my God, he has just blood from one end to the other. You suck. He fell off of his feet while he was being pulled. He went into the wall and then Plum Tree rammed his face into that steel folding chair on the Kamikaze Kid. Is I in think a, I have interest in this match. I think you want to get out of here. I think fast. I have interest in this match. I think you're a sick man, and so is Plum Tree. What did I do? You like this, don't you? I, I just noticed what happened to Kami's head. You're smiling. What happened to his head? Get out of here. Oh, no. count of two. Oh, and he kicked out. I don't know how Guess he did what? It. He had him. For a count of I just sit right over here because I got a mic and that way you can keep talking, right, Mac? Because I definitely got an entry. You know this. Explain JB Trask, get out of here. Oh! Woo! Big leg drop. Ah. This this is very scary. Two. The comic. Oh! He rolled now, the shoulder. He kicked out. Something. The guts and the determination of the kamikaze kid beyond reproach. What happened to his head? Get out of here. Don't you love me anymore, Mick? I thought you liked Yeah, you won the stomach flu. I do. What, what? Uh, you know, uh, it's going to be three on two coming up in the six-man tag. Because you're a funny man. Can't oh, now with the shoe. This is you're doing? absolute. You're inviting Mick? Oh, this ow. is carnage. Oh. This, this is nasty. We'll, we'll get to this match. We'll talk about the six-man later. This, Why don't you go back to the locker room? This is interesting. I'm really interested in this match. The Kamikaze Kid, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. You're interested because you want a shot at Lenny Lane? He's a crimson mask. He has been severely lacerated. In for the cover, count of one and That's two. It. Oh, and once again. This kid has got guts. I don't you that. bet he's got guts. He is a champion from the word go. How he is even functioning at this point is beyond description. Oh, now he's choking him. He choked his own oh, shirt. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen, I apologize, but this is, this is definitely a laceration that's going to require several yeah, stitches. I can see this. Yeah, this is going to be bad. This is for the belt. If you can't take it, you can't It's not it. for the belt because you cowards wouldn't put the belt up. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Look at that. A uh, vertical suplex. He's bleeding anyway. Textbook. And the, what remaining blood is in the poor kid's head. Has he did do a great job. Oh, my God. This is incredible. The Kamikaze Kid. Look at the. What are you, is he chewing gum? 15 minutes. Lenny Lane is chewing gum for crying out loud. 15 minutes in most time. 15. Oh no! God. Don't get that on the belt. Mortimer Plumtree. Well, he's hit him with a shoe. He's hit him with the belt. God, I wish somebody would have. Look at the crimson mask. He is absolutely baiting. He is antagonizing. He is humiliating the kamikaze kid who is lucky to be even standing right Look now. Trask. Over there helping Lenny Lane. Look at this. Oh, a shot from Trask now. The kid is fighting three people, ladies and gentlemen. This is a travesty. This is a travesty. There's blood all over the arena floor, on the walls, on the chairs. I'll tell you what, I've got the championship belt in front of me, and it's... Oh, oh no, my God. Oh, my God. The Kamikaze, oh, they've got to get this kid to the hospital. I'm sorry. He is absolutely pouring blood right now. This is not, this is not a pretty sight. I, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I really have to tell you, you don't have a strong stomach. Be careful of this. 
Look, look at our cameraman. He's turning look green. At this, look, this is what makes me sick. Look at the antics of Luscious Lenny Lane. That is a man bleeding like a stuck pig in look front at, of him, and he's dancing. Look at Lenny Lane's legs. He's covered with the kid's blood. You know, there, there, there comes a time when showmanship and arrogance has to go out the window, and you've got to have some compassion. I don't care how, how sick you are. And to dance in front of a man, to showboat when he's a bloody mess. Just pin him. Just pin him. The kid, obviously, a game battle. He's had to fight three people, and he's holding his own. Look at this cover. Count of one, two, and his feet are on the ropes for leverage. What has he got to put his feet on the ropes for? Going for a diamond. Well, talking about diamond, this guy could also stop the match. He could. I have a feeling that the kamikaze kid told him before the match, don't stop it under any circumstances. That's the kind of a kid he is. Let's face it, Tom, a very game, game battle on the part of the kid. Wait a minute now, he's trying to roll him up for the sunset, kind of one, two, no. Give the kid credit. That had to be instinctive. That's all he's got left, count of one. And again, referee Diamond pushing the feet off the ropes. Well, sorry for the interruption, I just have a few comments. What are you sticking morning. your nose in the watch match the for? the match, cars, just watch the match. The kamikaze kid needs medical attention, and he needs it now. This has been three-on-one handicap match Three with on you. One. It's one-on-one. On one. It's one-on-one. On one. If he needed medical attention, he'd walk out of here. He can't walk out of here, for heaven's sakes. He's a bloody mess. A block. He ducks the clothesline. Oh. Spinning kick. Oh, oh my God. Where, Where is? does he get it? Come on, Lenny. Come on. At the kid. Come on, kid. That's right, I said, come on, kid. Being biased. You bet. I'm unbiased. I'm sitting out here. Luscious Lenny Lane's got to be. This ain't even the main event. He's got to be the most frustrated man in the state of Minnesota. Sleeper hold. That's it. That good night, Irene, that sleeper hold in the middle of the ring, and this has got to be it for the kid. Give him credit, for heaven's sakes, Trask. He had to fight practically everybody in the building, a bloody mess, and he still hung in there for well, 20 course, minutes. Kid, I'm going to give him credit. He pinned me by some fluke. One, two, three, fluke. One, two, three, fluke. One, two, That's three. why I'm not wearing the strap right now. But I'll get, I'll get this, this is it. Ring the bell. God, well, we're getting ready to ring the bell because that sleeper hold is going to do him in. I'm sorry. Wait a second. Did he go down three times? I can't tell. No. He is not down for that third time. The kid is trying to fight out of this. Look at the determination. Oh, I can't believe it. How do you like that? Youth, determination, and enthusiasm. Look at the kid. Look at the kid. Oh, and again, Lenny Lane. I'm just going to go back and start celebrating right now. Good, good. Go back. I got prepared for this. Yeah, pop a champagne for all of us. Beat it. Get out of here. Oh, my. The kamikaze kid has not stopped pouring blood for a second, ladies and gentlemen. He has got to be absolutely weak and practically. You know, there's danger of his body going into shock here, Tom, from blood loss. He just hit Plumtree in the face with the kid's foot, putting him on the rope. All the way from the top. I don't like the looks of this at all. Are we so... 